Dear BLM and the like, you cannot fight against racism unless you get rid of your Bibles, your Qurans, your Torahs. This is what gave power to racism. A bunch of Christians thought that they would convert you guys to the Bible. They gave you their Christian names and then freed you from slavery that they were doing in the first place. All slavery was wrong. All of this is wrong. All of it was injustice. All of it's bad. But the Bible gives power to that. The Bible gives power to slavery. It condones slavery. The Quran, it's all racist. I even heard that Buddha said that women don't enter heaven. All these holy books, if you really want to fight, you at least have to fight that too. You're a hypocrite if you think you're fighting racism and you're not fighting against these things. Every bit of it, segregation, all that stuff was terrible. The worst, it's some of the worst injustice that's ever happened in the whole world. But it's these holy books that give it power. You want to fight it? Get the president to stop swearing on the Bible. Change the world by getting the power of racism out. Because these books give it power. People are not just naturally racist, but they believed for sure back then that they were doing God's will because of their books who say that blacks are slaves. That's terrible. If you want to fight the real fight, get rid of the Bible, get rid of the Quran, get rid of the Torah, Hindu, you name it, get rid of all these books that these people were racist and these books that control the world. Because you'll never be free, we'll never be free of this as long as people with their beliefs think that it's okay. So yeah, fight racism. Fight it good. But go to the source. It really is the source. Religion is what caused racism. It was not just random people becoming racist. So if you guys want to fight it, please fight it right. Burn your Bibles, rip those things up, do the real fight.